What is up? David here, guys. We're going to react to Childish Gambino in a moment. But the first thing I want to say is this guy here, Elliot Thompson, is here as a guest today. We're promoting his new song, Keep Me Around. It is the bomb. You checked out a few seconds of it before, but the video's on the channel. We're producing a whole album of his amazing music and his amazing voice. We want you guys to check it out, comment, and like it. Do it right after you watch this. Okay, Elliot Thompson. Say Thank hi, you. Elliot. Hi, hi. So, um, obviously, David here, we're going to react to Childish Cambino, and the song is called, I don't see it here, Lithonia. It's from his new movie, and uh, just came out in July of 2024. Like, subscribe, hit the bell icon for notifications, and leave comments. Okay? Now, I must say... I am not a huge connoisseur of Childish Gambino, so this is a really good reaction for me to do. He, on the other hand, likes him a lot. I love Childish Gambino. I love Donald Glover. I love everything about him. People call him the Renaissance man of the modern age. I'm really excited. I've actually heard this song before, but I can't wait to listen again. Yeah, so he has. I haven't. But so you know a lot more about it than I do. But let's just go, let's just roll with it. How we roll the video? Let's go. <laughs> That nobody gives a fuck <laughs> I did my job I paid my dues Love is for fools Cause nobody gives a fuck Yes! <laughs> that, to me, that's a classic intro. Yeah. I mean, he's, you know, he's taking it back to old pop roots. Um, but I know his past projects have been more experimental, more R&B, gospel vibes. I know the producer, uh, Ludwig, I believe, has been working with Gambino for quite a long time. I think he's uh, participated in a lot of Gambino's projects. So, and you can really hear him shine through in this as well. Huh, I'm looking forward to it. I love the Hammond organ. I'm a huge, <laughs> huge, huge Hammond organ fan. In fact, we just tracked some Hammond organ on his one of the songs we're working on for him this week. And... Um, I couldn't be more of a Hammond organ guy, and I just love that sound. And I also want to just say that his vocal right there, it sounds so raw. Like, that's just him singing into a mic. It doesn't sound like there's anything almost like unedited, just raw, feeling it vocals. Yeah, and I think that goes into the character he's playing, because I believe this song is a part of his new movie that's dropping. Right. Um, so I think he might be playing a character, but I could be wrong. I don't know. All right, let's go. Yeah. Fuck. Don't give a fuck. Listen to that bass. It's a creamy and fat. Yeah. Nobody gives a fuck. Uh. I feel liberated. Yes. Over medicated. Uh. It was already there. What you want? I can tell by the look on your Uh. I've been gone so long. Yes. Don't you know that this is the moment you're watching us throw it away? What I like about his voice, first of all, just the rock, the whole rock thing. It just, yeah. is it me, I love it. It's beautiful. And his voice is so pure. Like sometimes people try to put a lot on their vocal and they don't really sound like the way they talk. To me, like, there's not much of a difference between his singing voice and his speaking voice. Am I right? Yeah, 100%. I mean, you know, even though he pursues these alter egos, Gambino, Donald Glover, you know, he's the same throughout. He's got that weird quality. He loves, you know, pushing the boundaries of, you know, I mean, he has like experimental music, but he also has this comedy, which is absolutely hilarious. Mm. 
And, you know, even though he's taking it back to more pop traditional, you know, four chord roots for this song, uh, it still has his quality to it that is just, you know, completely recognizable. And I love it. Yeah. Love it. I love the hard rock thing. Yeah. Everyone's all sweaty. That nobody gives yeah. I'm pretty sure that drummer is in the movie Hereditary, you know, uh-huh. the, the horror movie. I'm pretty sure that's the actor. That's the guy? I didn't know he was a drummer. He looks like he's playing drums. Why is everyone so incredibly sweaty? I don't know. It must be really hot in there. No, 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 no. This has got to be. They're like spraying people. <laughs> they got to be like hosing yeah. people down. Dude, he looks frantic. Yeah. That's, I guess that's what they're supposed to be, I right? I guess so, yeah. It's so good. It's so funny. Nice. I've never seen the video before, so this is, <laughs> this is great. <laughs> How are you, motherfucker? Okay, that kind of scared the shit out of me, and I'm sure you guys loved how much that scared the shit out of me. Cause you like scared me, but I kept it inside. Did you? Yeah. That was awesome. The dude's eyes just exploded. Yeah, nothing about that was awesome for me. I hated that. I love that. See, oh, I, oh, I love... Really? Yeah. You, does that bother you? Dude, I'm like... <laughs> you don't like gross stuff? No, I, no, it's fine. It was funny. It was funny. But wait, what don't you like about it? I'm curious. No, no I was joking. Okay. <laughs> I love it. Let's see what happens. Hello? Oh, that's the whole thing? That's the whole song? Dude! Okay. All right. So that's short. It's a, it's just like a little scene right there. Now I got. How do we know what happens? We had to see the movie. I guess so. I mean, I know the song goes for longer. I've listened to it, but oh, does it? Yeah. So all right. So I was expecting a whole like part two. Yeah. I thought that was just the intro. Yeah. So anyway, I thought that was funny. I thought that was really well done. Um, you know, I want to talk about something too. If you notice, the drummer is riding but like when you're going like this on a symbol consistently it's called riding Mm -hmm. right but the ride symbol has a tingy a little tingy belly sound and he was on a crash symbol which is that crash crash crashy sound what does that do to the song riding on the ride or riding on the crash what does that do to the song changes the feeling changes the feeling entirely if it's a if it's crash heavy then it's going to be more, I mean, naturally, it's going to be higher energy. Mm-hmm. You know, it's going to complement the rest of the instrumental in this song very well. Uh, if it was in the ride, it'd be, I guess, I don't even know, more jazzy, more. Or just like me- more mellow. Whenever I, whenever I see someone cr- riding on a crash, I think, ah, like the energy's like, ah. It's yeah. like you can't get more energy than that. So obviously that's what they wanted to convey here. Exactly. And uh, if he was like just on the ride symbol, it would have been, it wouldn't have had that like, bam, like punch you in the face kind of impact. I like the punchiness though. I really yeah. Like no, it. me too. I love it. Yeah. I love it. I think I think it's it was perfect, and I think that's great. So it 100%. makes me actually honestly want to see the movie. I want to see the movie. Yeah. I, is it a horror movie? How is it a horror movie? You guys, you got you subs, you you fans of Childish Gambino will answer this question. I don't know. I don't know. About so anyway, we're gonna check it out. But also, guys, keep me around. Elliot Thompson's music video that's on this channel. Please check that out. I a, a because I want to help break this guy, but B, it is such a killer song with all the dynamics, instrumentation, harmonies, like. It's just in the in his voice. I mean, it goes up against anyone. It's so awesome. Check this dude out. He's going somewhere. Help us break him on this channel. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the bell icon for notifications. Leave comments. Want to hear your comments? And uh, I don't know. That's it, Elliot. Anything more to say? Nothing else. Thank you for the endorsement. Thank you for having me, David. Love you guys. Peace. Have a musical day. Bye bye. Bye.